Let's talk about mass transit in detail. Citrus Connection, our bus system here in Polk County, uh, is how so many of our, our residents and neighbors get around to the doctor to get groceries. This is how they go to work, their school. Uh, they're connected to the rest of the world this way. We have 60,000 households that make $25,000 or less per year. These are uh, folks that do rely on mass transit. We're subsidized by the federal government for 50% of this in cities of Lakeland and Winter Haven, and the rural route is subsidized 90% by the federal government. So this is money that's coming into Polk County to help us pay for the buses. If we get rid of the buses and we've got Uber cars or something like that, you lose the federal funding. And plus, let's look at a specific example. Folks that live in Lakeland that take the bus over to Winter Haven to work at Legoland, pay $2 each way uh, to go to work on the bus. If you take an Uber, that's $20 each way. $40, that's half a day's pay just to go to work. Where's the sense in that? I think we, we need people who understand not only how we're spending the money, but where the money comes from and how the budgets work. And with our, our Citrus Connection, we have a great system. We have public and private partnerships with corporations, with the school board for our students, with the sheriff's charities for the summer vacation students to be able to take a bus instead of walk on the streets. That's keeping their kids safe. These are all programs that have great detail and are interworking with each other. So we need to stick with the program we've got. None of this, let's get rid of the buses and, and bring in a bunch of Uber cars. With 1.44 million rides a year, how are we ever gonna be able to handle all those cars? That's just, that's just crazy. Polk County can do better, we can do better.